Firstly, you need to blend a cup of oats and turn them into flour. Then for your wet ingredients, take a cup of soy milk or any plant-based milk, a gulp of apple cider vinegar, a teaspoonful of coconut oil and two teaspoons of agave, then mix this all in a bowl or jug until thoroughly combined. Now add your oats as well as three quarters of a cup of spelt flour or any flour of your choice, plus a tablespoon of baking powder and a tiny amount of salt. Mix again until it looks creamy and forms little bubbles at the surface. Then heat up your waffle iron and cook your waffles until nicely raised and golden brown. Then add any fruit or topping of your choice. I also put some maple syrup on top and added a bit of love chuck chocolate because it's my favorite and melts nicely over all the waffles. This is completely sugar free and absolutely delicious and yeah, I would totally recommend you trying this recipe. Enjoy! Yes. Mmm. Mm. Need to have another bite. Mm. Okay, great. 10 out of 10. I'm just gonna go out and say it. I don't think I've ever made more delicious waffles. They're not usually my waffles get super like bready. This time they are the perfect consistency. Aesthetically pleasing, which is one of my three I have like taste. Um, creativity of the recipe and the aesthetics so all three levels I mean I think this is this is a bomb recipe and we're talking now and um, this is my breakfast for a day where you obviously have a bit more time to prepare it and like maybe fancy treating yourself and yeah it's Sunday today so I usually on Sunday make either pancakes or waffles so today was a waffle day and if you recreate this and post it somewhere, please add this hashtag or tag me so that I can go and like it. Um, like this video if you want to make these waffles and stick around because tomorrow is another recipe day and you're gonna have one every single day this month. So cheers to that um, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Take care, thanks for watching, bye!